for You Sports, sponsored by your Oklahoma Ford dealers. Oh, Thunder Nation was holding its breath tonight. Russell Westbrook limping off the floor with what turns out to be a sprained ankle. Didn't look good. Unknown how long he might be out. Those are usually, you know, two, three weeks. OKC hosting New Orleans. Russ out for the fourth quarter. Never fear, Dennis Schroeder is here. 16 of his 22 points come in the second half. Make it five straight wins for the good guys. 122-116, the final Thunder above 500 for the first time this season at 5-4. and four. And welcome into sports, everybody. It is Bedlam Week, and Mike Gundy's dog, Kinsey, a Monday press conference regular, seems a bit on edge. Uh, but to him, um, uh, just <laughs> was that the bad guy or what? Yeah, Kinsey's fired up. Now, unlike many recent meetings, only one of these teams, a Big 12 title contender right now, Gundy, looking for just his third Bedlam win in 14 seasons as head coach, says there's no secret why. Mike, what do you think is the biggest reason <clears throat> that your teams have struggled against OU throughout the years? I think they're good. Have you watched them play? If you, everybody struggled against them, they're a good team. I think that's a bigger factor. Yeah, that's about right. Meanwhile in Norman, Jacob Toby with those Sooners who are favored by 18 this week. Thanks, Caden. It's Bedlam Week here in Norman, a historic matchup between these two teams. This will be the 113th meeting between the Sooners and the Cowboys. OU knows the Cowboys have struggled so far this year, but they've got some talented guys on both sides of the ball. Another great opportunity for us as a team uh, against a good team. Um, Obviously, there's a rivalry. Obviously, you know, it'll be intense on Saturday. Um, I think their running back is really good. Uh, Justice Hill, I think he's really good. I watched him on tape um, this morning and yesterday. So um, I think he's real good, real explosive guy. He can make you miss and he often hit the hole. You know, I've got a tremendous amount of respect for him. You know, we've had a lot of battles against him over the years. Uh, he's a tremendous football player, easily one of the best running backs in the country. Um, and they, they've done a great job continuing to get him involved, and he's, a, he's just he's tremendous. Receiver Tylen Wallace obviously stands out as well. It has been great for them all year. Been one of, the, one of the best receivers in this league and in the country. You heard Lincoln Riley talk about the offensive skill positions for the Cowboys. Wallace at wide receiver, Hill at running back. If both of those guys have good games against a subpar OU defense, this game just may be a bit more intriguing than at first glance. Reporting here in Norman, Jacob Toby, Two Works For You.